UK police are investigating after anti-Semitic graffiti was painted on more than a dozen sites across London. The racist messages peddled a conspiracy theory that Jewish people were responsible for the 9-11 attacks. A trail of hate-filled graffiti scrawled overnight onto the front of shops, telephone boxes and a synagogue. A spray-painted Star of David and the numbers 9-11 thought to be a reference to an anti-Semitic conspiracy theory that Jews were behind the terror attack. Hampstead councillor Oliver Cooper was so appalled by the extent of what he saw, he spent the morning documenting each and every location. And this is the first time that we've seen something anywhere on this scale. One Jewish resident uh, told me that it reminded him of Kristallnacht. Uh, and if we're comparing incidents like this to some of the greatest horrors the Jewish people have faced in history, then that's a real wake-up call to all of us to act. Cleaning teams scrubbed away the worst, but it was up long enough to have a deeply distressing impact on those who have lived in this community for years. It doesn't matter where it is in the world, where in the country, it's awful, horrendous, wherever it is, but to have it on your doorstep where you come every day, it's quite scary, it's quite alarming, it's upsetting, and it also makes you angry. It feels like quite an attack, actually. It feels like a, a very physical attack, uh, particularly given what's been going on in New York overnight. Uh, so I woke up to that and then to this following on from it. Uh, I think it feels, it feels quite frightening. I think people are afraid. While most of the graffiti has now been washed away, police say they are taking what happened here incredibly seriously and that they are committed to tackling hate crime in all forms. But campaigners say what's equally important is that the rising number of incidents like these are recognised at a national level. In a tweet, London Mayor Sadiq Khan said this makes me sick to my stomach, that the Met Police are investigating and we will not tolerate abuse or intimidation of our Jewish community. There were 8,566 religious hate crimes recorded by police in England and Wales in 2018 to 19. Of those, 1,326 targeted people of Jewish faith, compared to 672 in the previous year. That's an increase of 97%. Anti-Jewish racism has always existed on the far right and on the far left of society. What I think has happened is it's tended to migrate into the centre of society over the last few years. Unfortunately, there's been a lot more talk in the media about anti-Jewish racism and therefore those who hold these views have perhaps, perhaps felt emboldened. It is particularly distressing coming at a time when Jewish people around the world marked the last night of Hanukkah lighting candles to commemorate the strengths of the Jewish community through times of prejudice and hatred.